Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Chairman Asus Tech, Johnny Shi. Welcome. Thanks for coming. 2009 has been an exciting year for innovation and strides for ASUS. Despite of being a year of troubling financial times throughout the world, ASUS's long-run vision and planning have led to continued growth and leadership in the PC markets around the world. Our sector did well in growing. On average, 25% on a quarter over quarter basis in Q3, 2009. With the financial crisis, in the US and in the world, this is not a bad performance. But let's have a look at how ASUS did in the same time period. That's right, 56%. That's more than double the growth performance compared to the industry average. The key to this level of leadership and performance is the ASUS innovations. Just in the last year, we were recognized with over 3,200 awards for innovation and for design. We are talking about the real editor's choice or Best Buy or like the National Design Award Let's have a look a few of the highlights. These awards span from the Red Dot Design Award to the IF Product Design Award to the CNET Editor's Choice, the Laptop Editor's Choice, the Computer Shoppers Editor's Choice, We also appreciate a lot that we have got quite an improvement in the media coverage uh, than before, including the world's leading media channels, such as the New York Times, Washington Post, Forbes, Fortune, and CNN. For 2010, we have already garnered five CES awards. Our matrix GT285, the most reliable high performance video cars. Our RTN16 router. The touch screen, the touch screen based SV1T video phone. <coughs> the Disney NetPal MK90H. Very elegant, sleek, dual lamp LCD monitor. From the awards to worldwide acknowledgments from mainstream press to healthy company growth, we are well on our way to our goal to be one of the top three portable PC vendors by 2011. 